had a long line of kids getting free stuff like backpacks, erasers, and stuff needed for school. I got a book bag and some school supplies. I got crazy art, 24 crazy art. What's your favorite part? Uh, food. All right, I'm here with the areas. He got a backpack. I'm gonna show him what he got inside and how he feels. Sometimes I didn't have pencils or backpacks or whatever, yada yada, you want to put it there. Um, so we came up with this and we feel like it's important to do it every year to make sure everyone get a piece of the, get a piece of the, uh, piece of the pie. Do you want a book, coloring book, word search? We want to bring a different aspect to everyone out there that's looking at us, even the young kids, you know what I mean? Give them something to look up to, give, give them a different avenue, you know what I mean? You don't have to go to college, you don't got to do trade school, you can start this business. And you don't have to start clothing business, you don't have to rap, you can start a nonprofit. When I was younger, I came here to get my physical at this building right here when I played Metro. Uh, one of the coaches at a cookout, we cleaned cars and over there in that parking lot, you know what I mean? So we did a lot of stuff when we was kids in this, in this same park. And for us to grow up, you know, as young adults, to actually do something, you know, major like this, it's just, it's just a great feeling. I just graduated college three years ago, so it's more like, instead of me going out and doing something else, I want to do this. So here I am, how you doing? Here I am, making sure that we still giving back to the community and creating the traditions that we need. It's more like we've been, we've been planted the seed. You know, now we're starting to see the, you know, the little roots and grass come up now. So it's more like this is something we always wanted to do. So it's really no surprise to us. And us just taking action, really giving back, you know, that's just a plus. He's trying to make Fort Wayne community the better place to live for people. And you know, I appreciate that a lot since I'm from the area. By the looks of it, looks like he's got a pretty big uh, community of people that he affects positively. And all I know is he's just trying to help everybody who's not as fortunate as, as I am, I guess, for instance, and just help them to get on their feet before they go to school. I, every time I looked up, I, I always saw the line, and it was always back to the basketball courts and everything, so uh -huh. I kept going and kept going kept going, so I thought it was awesome um, that this many people came out to it and that we had enough things to, you know, get a, give them and get them started with school. Uh, being with St. Francis and all that stuff, he's been deep with the football and stuff like that, but like I said, he's out to help the kids, help all the families he can. We, we brought all the kids. <laughs> with the tribe, so yeah. we were happy to help donate. Yeah. And it's hot sun burning up, but we're here for the kids, so. I think giving back to the community is always a positive thing, and then it's a nice way to stop the violence if we all just start coming together. I think it's important to give back to the community as well. I think people need to understand that that's so detrimental for just the city of Fort Wayne in general. With the, all of them being so young, um, I think that they're really sparking something in the community, and uh, Keep it up. I'm, I'm going to support them all the time. Well, Black Women of Excellence is a support group, so this is an opportunity to, to support the south side of town and support the people of Fort Wayne. So any way we can help, we are willing to help. We, we know there's a need on the south side of town, um, and so myself, Adam Blakey Holiday Foundation, and three other organizations uh, got together and came up with this idea. Excuse me, can yes, you go sir. in there? Yes, you can, absolutely. Play money, money. I mean, I love coming out to these. I mean, uh, if kids, if this vehicle's like a kid magnet. They just run to it. They want to get in it and see everything and ask a thousand questions. So, yeah, we always enjoy coming out here. You know, I, I think the backpack giveaway is just a fantastic thing, too. Uh, getting them ready for school, which they don't want to think about. But uh, but uh, as, as far as parents and whatnot go, it's important for them. Uh, it takes a lot of uh, load off of their mind and things of that nature. What can I get for you guys? I got my daughter out here with me. You know, I got my little sister out here with me. We're going to, you know, we're going to support every opportunity we get. And, you know, this thing is just going to keep ke catching traction and more traction. And it's going to turn into something none of us ever, ever seen coming. It's, I'm so proud of him because it's not a lot of, you know, men that does that. You know what I'm saying? Coming from where he's coming from and getting where he's at right now, it's amazing. I'm so proud of him. I really am. Thank you. Man. I really am. For a very short time, I used to be in, in that situation where I wondered where, where my son's next backpack was going to come or his supplies were going to come. Um, fortunately, I had a, my mom would help us out quite a bit. So, I mean, at, now at this point, I'm at a point in life where I don't have to make those decisions like that, but I could only imagine how a parent could feel that way, you know, and, and I hate to see or think that that would happen to, to kids that they wouldn't be able to get to school or be able to perform in school the way they would need to just because they don't have some supplies. What we doing? We're completing our mission right now. This is what we want to do and help, help the community give back. Three years we've been growing, so I mean, it's going to keep getting bigger and better. Just look at the turnout. It's a great turnout, and this is what we love. This is what we do. I, I honestly believe, like, we're going to be the biggest nonprofit in Fort Wayne ever. ever. Like, seriously, to be honest, we nationwide. Ever. You always got to remember, it's bigger than you. It's bigger than us. That's why we're doing this, BTU. That's, what, that's our motto. That's, that's what we stand on. 
making sure that we give back to everyone else. So when you have a chance to give back, make sure you do so.